The property owner says last night two men were seen leaving this house on Northview Drive. Upon inspection, the owner noticed missing air and heating units and the five ton air conditioner outside is also gone. Rhonda Rogers rents and leases properties all over Jackson. She's worried about her property specifically in Fondren. Roger says Friday morning she filed a police report after a property on Northview Drive was broken into. And judging by what was taken, she says the looters had to be professionals. Uh, two men in a white truck were backing out of the driveway. So when we got here, we found that they had come in through the window and they had cut the main heating and air unit out of the middle of the house. She says they cut the gas and electric lines outside to take off with a five ton air conditioner. Because of other break ins nearby, she says the Fondren area is going downhill fast. Our main thing is that we have so many abandoned homes. I mean, probably for every two homes, there's one abandoned next to it. And um, we have so many homeless people in the area that they just go in the homes and make them their home and you can't really get them out. Jackson police say a formal complaint was made after the robbery Thursday night and a case number was drawn for burglary. Roger says detectives told her the fingerprints taken from inside the house wouldn't yield results for up to seven weeks. She says it's up to the community to step up and report suspicious activity. We don't have enough police. I mean, we don't have enough police cars. They can't do it all. They can't do it all. Rogers believes more street lights along Northview Drive could help to curb some crime. She says she pays Energy extra to keep the lights on around this property. Live in Jackson, Jennifer Lott, 16 WAPT News.